My name is Alice and I'm a dance teaching artist and today we're going to explore flamenco. This video is part of the Kennedy Center's Teaching Artists Present series where teaching artists from all over the country share arts activities you can enjoy from your own home. Flamenco comes from Spain and it has influences from cultures all over the world. I fell in love with flamenco because of its intense and intricate rhythms. All you need for today's activity is yourself. I have special shoes and a wood floor, but you can wear any shoes, your sneakers, slippers, or be barefoot, and any floor will work. If you're not able to stand, you can do the footwork seated, or you can even play the rhythms on your body. Come on down to my flamenco studio and we'll get started. The first thing we have to do before we can get to the dancing is learn how to stand like a flamenco dancer. So I want you to stand up as tall as you possibly can, feet close together, imagine there were a string attached to the top of your head and someone was lengthening you up taller and stand with your hands on your hips, nice and broad across the front of your chest. This is our flamenco dance posture. The rhythm, or the compas, is the glue that holds the dancer together with the guitarist, the singer, other musicians, and other dancers. We hold the rhythm with palmas, rhythmic hand claps. There are two types of palmas. The first one is called palmas sordas. I want you to cup your hands like this and turn them in opposite directions from one another and go ahead and clap. You get a very muffled sound. Our second type of palma is called palmas secas, crisp or dry palma. Take the hand that you write with and hold those three middle fingers nice and strong. On the opposite hand, the center of your palm is the center of your drum head. And I want you to hit right in the center there. And you get a very crisp sound. Let's warm up our rhythms. I will play a rhythm with my palmas and I want you to play it right after me. Nice and tall, strong palmas. Bien hecho, good job. Now let's learn a flamenco rhythm. We're going to learn a flamenco rhythm with four counts. Standing up nice and tall, get your palmas ready. Stomp on count one, clap two, three, four. And one, two, three, four. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro. Uno, loud, soft, loud. Switch to secas. Listen carefully. And close. Very good, muy bien. Now it's time for one of my favorite parts of flamenco. Making rhythms with our feet. First, we'll learn all five of our footwork sounds. Come on. Standing in flamenco position, we'll bend our knee and stomp the whole foot on the floor to make a golpe. Try the other foot. Now let's switch feet. A little bit faster. Keep standing up nice and strong. Our second sound is planta, the ball of the foot. Same motion, just keep the heel off the floor. Switching feet. It's almost like we're tiptoeing, but making a lot of noise. Third sound is tacón, the heel. This time, I keep my feet on the ground close together, lift the heel, send it straight into the ground. 
Switching feet. Twice as fast. As fast as you can go. Our fourth sound is called tacón. Didn't I just say that? Yep. We have two ways we can use our tacones, our heels, in flamenco. We can also dig or jab our heel. Try the other foot. Our fifth and final sound is punta, the point of the shoe. Try the other side. Let's try putting a couple of our sounds together. We'll add the tacón to the planta. Here we go. Twice as fast. Now let's play call and response. I'll make up a rhythm and I want you to repeat it right after me. Stand tall in flamenco position. One more. Let's try some more complicated patterns with other sounds. We'll do planta, tacón with two golpes. Planta, tacón, two golpes. A little faster. Let's try that one and we're going to add a pause after the planta. Listen carefully. Don't lose the pause. With those five sounds, we can make short patterns like we just did, medium patterns, or really long patterns like this. Now it's your turn. I want you to see how many different patterns you can make with those five footwork sounds. I hope that you have enjoyed this video and that you'll explore other videos on the Kennedy Center's Teaching Artists Present collection. And as we say in flamenco, ole! Thanks for watching.